Life-size replicas of fetuses, too much for lunchtime at Brantford High School. A student leader of the school's pro-life club says the principal banned her from using those models, and she's fighting that. News 8's A.J. Walker has more. 17-year-old Samantha is a senior at Brantford High School, and she's learning a harsh lesson in education policy after trying to set up a pro-life table during lunch at Brantford High. When we asked the principal at our school if we can have this set up during lunch and, you know, have an opportunity for kids to come over and take a look at our display, we were told no. Samantha is the founder of the Students for Life Club. Their table is complete with blown-up images of fetuses and real life-sized fetus models that look just like the real thing and she says that doesn't sit well with her principal. He tells us that this topic in particular is too controversial to be talked about in public school. But she says other school clubs are able to promote their views during lunch. They had information about what their club does and what they've done in the past and they have pictures and they have, you know, poster boards just like ours, except with different content on it. We reached out to the principal of Brantford High School. We reached out to the superintendent of the school district. Neither had a comment and would speak to us today. But Samantha says she's not giving up. She's going to continue to fight for her right to have her views heard. If we're taught what is going to happen when we do have sex. We need to talk. Uh, we need to be taught about what's going to happen after we have sex if uh, contraceptives don't follow through. One Brantford parent says she doesn't see the problem with Samantha's pro-life display. There's nothing wrong with that. I don't think so. I think it's fine. This is what a baby looks like as it's growing in a mommy's belly. She even let her elementary age children see it. Just a life cycle of a baby, like like a life cycle that you learn in school. She plans to set up her pro-life display on April 6th on the Brantford Green. Meanwhile, she's hoping the school district will reconsider. In Brantford, A.J. Walker, News 8.